a village? Here? Amnesia. A child never runs away without a reason. It is easy to spill blood, but to love, to protect. I'm going to find him. He doesn't want to see you. Who are you talking to, Mommy? I have to see him. He doesn't need you anymore. Why didn't you tell me Mommy was alive? It was for your own good, Hugo. That's not true. You didn't want me to know. Shut up. Let go of me. I did it for him. And I'll kill you again if I have to. I'll kill all of you. Hugo, is that you? Someone's coming. It's me, Hugo. Mommy, is that you? No, no. I'm coming. Hugo. What are you doing? Come here. No. This no, Nicholas. Don't touch him. No. Where is your Hugo. sister? Run. Can I stay? Get away from me. Hugo. Hugo, no. It is done. Can I go and see my mother now? Only the Grand Inquisitor may say. But you told me. My words are of no importance. Only those of the Grand Inquisitor. But be sure, you are very precious to him indeed. Four nights in a row I've been on Episangri's duty. When's it gonna end, eh? Soon. The hour of conjuration approaches. But think of Vitalis. Your ordeal is nothing compared to his. What was that? Hmm. All right. Someone is 
coming. Medicus, how has today's refining gone? The quality is excellent, but the mass of raw episanguis is decreasing. Our harvesters are being decimated by the rats. Do your best. The life of the Grand Inquisitor depends on the quality of the distillate. The body of the Grand Inquisitor is overwhelmed by the bite. I fear it will now attack his mind. Don't worry. The boy's blood will restore the powers of Olivia. Devil! Have It will soon be necessary to change the filters and scrape the tank. We have almost reached the objective. I hope so, because that's all we'll be able to produce. It is already a miracle that Vitali's body can take such hey. quantities. I'm afraid. I'm afraid. I'm calling the city during the conjuration. You on the list? All. Yeah. I'll be on the square in front of the cathedral. Oh, so you'll be right next to the Grand Inquisitor when he frees us. And I'll be stuck here. We'll all meet again afterwards. The end of the bite. It's going to be quite a party. <laughs> Be brave. Grand Inquisitor is very busy. Busy? I am the Archbishop. I represent the Pope. Monseigneur, the mission of the Grand Inquisitor is sacred. His mission was never approved by the Church. I see here only heresy and occultism. And you. <coughs> My head. Shh, shut up. <coughs> Measure your words, Excellency. Your Me. words should make you more. Where are you? Madness!
Magister, the text clearly mentions the ascension of a child during the Great Plague of Justinian. I knew it. The Roman nobles isolated him from the people and worshipped him in secret. Maybe an ancestor of Hugo de Rune. Continue. They're talking about me. I bring the country from the bite. The, the Prima Macula. The on the cusp of the first threshold. Uh, there's something there, I'm sure of it. Archbishop Let's Gucci's go and check. Presence here says a lot. The Pope's court is worried, and so they should be. Serves them right for not intervening earlier. Nothing. Time to move on. Beatrice de Rune's research texts are all coded. I give up. I have some good news. They finally moved her to the basement. So she's going to crack. About time. Mommy. Grand Inquisitor, the Archbishop has arrived. Perfect. Bring him in. Vitalis. Monseigneur Gautier, I trust your journey went well. Now spare me your niceties. We grow tired of your little game, Vitalis. A game, Archbishop? <laughs> Can a game change the future of the world? Listen to yourself. You have completely lost your mind. And all this is... If I may, it's important. We have the blood of Hugo de Hun. Have you tested it? Yes. Uh, alas, Monseigneur. The boy should have reached the first threshold already, but it seems something in his blood has slowed the process. The macula is still in its original state. No matter. If the books are correct, my blood and his will be bound. When he reaches the next threshold, I shall reach it with him. Proceed.
That's enough. You play the martyr. But allow me to tell you the truth. You are a vile heretic driven mad by power. The Pope considers you a threat. Italis Benevon, you are to be excommunicated. One can excommunicate a man, Archbishop. Huh. But not a saint. Your inquisition is over. Meaning that a new era commences. One where puppets such as yourself will kneel and beg me to save them. Is with us. Very good. Go and see whether Beatrice de Rune has regained consciousness. He's scary, but I have to follow him. Why does she keep resisting like that? We have the same goal. We both fight the plague. Only our methods differ. The daughter is making the same error. <sighs> Stupid. Attention! But the brother, he is unique. He might understand. Unique? I'm unique? At ease. Ad ignem. Ad lucem, sir. So, you saw the Grand Inquisitor? Yes. The blood of the carrier flows through his veins. The conjuration will take place. Splendid. The end of the plague is nigh. Indeed. But do not lower your guard. Congratulations on capturing the child. We've been after him for weeks. And then he simply turns up here asking to see his mother. Huh. <laughs> it seems he has a sense of humor. That he won't be keeping for long. I have to go and see his mother myself. What's he going to do with her? I was told that the carrier of the Matinee. Is that right? The child turned himself in this morning. Apparently there was a... As I was telling you, this guard was devoured. But not completely. His bones were cut up and taken away by the rats. For what purpose? To incorporate them into that material we find everywhere. You mean their nests? They use our dead to build their nests. Precisely. And if we do nothing, 
At the rate the dead are accumulating, the nests will eventually join together to form one giant nest. It's just a matter of time. So let us pray that Vitalis' conjuration ceremony will indeed take place. Where is he? I won't find Mammy without him. What? There, let's go take a closer look. Tell me. Why can't I hear you like the others? Seeing as we have to transport them. You have nothing to fear from them. No point continuing. There's nothing here. Uh, tell me. Your new rats here. Seeing as we have to transport them. You have nothing to fear from them. Hey, kid. Take you cross breathing. Help me. Help me. What's wrong with him now? Hey, oh, no. die quietly. We're trying to work here. I'd rather he waited a little while. Rats prefer fresh. Damn you! You'll all go to hell! You, you and your fucking rats! Save her this respite. He's going to get mommy. Your death <laughs> is not an end. For your blood shall nourish a new race of angels. They shall be your children. Your pride. It's horrible. <sighs> If she sees her son with a knife to his throat, she'll cooperate. I saw Lord Nicholas go past. That Darun woman is gonna suffer, I'd say. Huh. Serves her right. Uh, such an educated woman. She should have joined our side. Oh, no. She's way too stubborn. But no match for our torture. We can't get out. Ah, please. At least let me die out there. You wouldn't like it out there, believe me. At least here your carcass can still be of value to our alchemists. <laughs> Think yourself lucky. Oh, bastard. Doing here? Shh! I have to find my mommy. The alchemist. Oh goodness! You shouldn't. Sorry, I need to go. Goodbye. Magistrate Aron. He's talking to mommy. For the last time. Will you answer my questions? Or perhaps you are still upset about what happened to your husband. Right. Our torturer will take care of you. You'll soon have your voice back. Mark my words. Oh no, he's coming back. Darling, you must go if they find you here. No, I'm staying with you. Oh, Hugo. Did they take your blood? Oh my god. All right, Hugo. We'll go together. 
But you have to find the keys. They must keep them in the room at the end of the corridor. Can you make it there? Off you go then. Go. Be very careful. Come back as soon as you have the keys. When I return, I want everything prepared and ready to begin. Do you understand? Yes, Lord Nicholas. All right. You heard it. Everything will be ready. The alchemist will talk. I'm going to enjoy it. Just do your job. The captain of the guard doesn't appreciate improvisation, and neither do I. Uh, yes, of course. Let me know when you're ready. I have to meet them here. Right. This might get me a promotion. Authority, results. I don't right then. To be efficient. Not the room. No pointless showmanship. Real lady. So soft. Anyway, the knives are sharpened. Hammer, pliers, vibrant saw. Everything is ready. Have I forgotten anything? Hmm. With the captain around, the best double check. Lanterns.
still get by. I have to get them out of there. Maybe with the other lantern. I've got to go back. I have to move the rats. I did it. All by myself. What does it say? It says it wants me to join it. The first threshold. Tommy, I'm scared. We'll never get out of here. We don't have a choice. If I am with you, the voice, are you ready to reply? Hugo, can you hear them? Mm, yes. They all have the same voice. The one that makes my head hurt. Don't try to ignore it. Embrace it completely. Don't be afraid. Yes. Everything is all right. Well done. You see? My headache's gone. It was the macula, but you answered it. Let's get going. Those creeps. They must have let rats loose on the prisoners again. Come on. Find this document and get out of here. I can't. We'll make him leave. Use the rats. Will they eat him? Rats? <laughs> Run, you big coward. You're scared, aren't you? Oh, Hugo, this is not a game. This power is dangerous. You have to control yourself. Yes, Mummy. So, that's my disease. You're not sick, Hugo. It's a... It's a gift. I'll explain later. A gift? Ah! Oh, you found her! Oh. oh, maybe I'm going crazy. What the hell are the rats doing here? What the hell happened?
these roads are in a terrible state. How are we going to deliver this? All we need now is to lose one of these cages. Be careful. they do to them? They make them eat people's blood. Really? Yes, it's strange. I can feel the black rats, but not these ones. I see. We need to find a way to get out of here. What are they going to do with these rats? Still all right, Hugo. It feels a bit funny. It will make you tired. That's no. Tell me if you feel poorly. Yes. Mummy, why do I know how to do this? It's. It's the blood that decides. It's complicated to explain. But Amicia doesn't know. No. I'll explain later. We had an argument, Mommy. It's all right, my darling. Let's get out of here, huh? So, Beatrice, you are reunited with your son at last. I know what you have done to him. You have taken what you wanted, now let him go. Oh, you insult me, Madame de Rune. Your son is the natural carrier of the macula. And it has not yet finished with him. Which means, neither have I. But this you know. Vitalis, let us finish this. Nicolas, you cannot understand. You feel it as I do. Do you not, boy? We are bound by blood now. What do you think, Hugo? Your family grows larger, huh? I beg of you. I promise to help you, but allow my son to leave. His destiny is not to be a Darun. His destiny is to be here, at my side. You are a monster. A monster? Madame, you have yet to see just how. Let's go! 
be strong. The Prima Macula. It's reacting. Continue! Stop torturing him! I'll tell you everything you want to know. It's too late. Come on! The child is weakening! Yes! The The threshold awaits you! Fast to the other side! No, Hugo, don't listen! Come to me! I'm ready! My son, don't forget who you are! That's enough! Say something. Hugo, can you hear me? Oh no. He is powerful, but he has not reached the threshold as we'd hoped. Do you know why? Amicia. It's Amicia. How tiresome. But he's close now, and we have other pawns we can play. Take her away. Leave him alone! What else do you want? <laughs> A lot more. So much more. And you will stay here with me to make sure we get it. Do not worry, Hugo. I have complete faith in you. We shall succeed.